Hey guys, it's SD. Now we started putting the vertical access together. Now we got done late last night about 10 o'clock. We're doing stuff with flashlights. I came out here and made some final adjustments to the bottom uh, rotor here. But she seems to be uh, doing pretty good. Spins nice and free. It's a big old monster stator. It's about an inch and an uh, eighth thick. It's uh, 150 wraps on each coil of number 15 wire. And uh, here's the jack bolts he used here. Went to the neighbors and we spot welded the nut on there. It's the idea we got from Muddy Mud Mudman. It's a pretty good idea. And boy, did it sure help using the jack bolts getting this up because this thing was about ready to slam against the other stator there. But we can take these out now. Got it fairly well adjusted. And uh, these are long winded, they're about six inches long. Save these for the next build. And uh, these other four bolts are uh, gonna bring up one of the wings and it's gonna bolt right to it. So when the uh, wind moves the blades, it's gonna move the magnets at the same time. Let's get this thing out of here. And a long winded bolt, isn't it? Anyway, if you look down here at the bottom, you'll see a four pole bolt pattern. That's gonna go up on each of these here. One, two, three, four, right here. It'll slide up and then it'll bolt that in place. So if I have another couple of uh, bolts right here that uh, will space it down and give us some clearance. Blades are uh, 61 inches tall. Uh, excuse me, the wings are. So I'll get them uh, installed and we'll start testing this. I might have to uh, decrease the uh, length here of the overall uh, wing arm uh, to match the RPMs I want. We pretty much you get 10-15 uh, miles an hour wind uh, most of the time here. We get some pretty heavy 80 mile an hour sometime, but uh, we'll see if we can tune this up to match. I don't know if I'm still going to go with a uh, 12 volt or a 24 volt system. But anyway, she's up and, and it's spinning. Fairly decent clearance there between that one. Spins nice and free with this little, that little force I put on it. Alright guys, we'll catch you later on. Hey guys, it's SD. Uh, we got these uh, wing arms put on here now. And everything's working out pretty good. Getting ready to uh, start attaching the wings. So as I progress, I'll try to do another little update every so and then. Got about a two to five mile an hour breeze coming through here. Just enough to kind of shake the leaves a little bit. Nothing much, but it's channeling right through this area where I'm going to be set up at. And it spins up pretty nice. Again, I got to see if these uh, blade arms are going to be too long. I'm going to try to match the uh, RPMs to uh, daily wind speed. So it'll work, work okay with the uh, 12 volt system for now, unless I go to 24 volt. So anyway, let me start going and attaching these uh, wings and we'll see if I can keep updating you. We'll see you later. Hey guys, this is SD. A little update, got the wings on. We hardly got three to maybe six mile an hour wind, if anything, coming through here. This thing, it started right up. Uh, Wait for a little better wind and we'll get some voltage test and I still got to do the wiring of the uh, three phase I'll wire it up in, in uh, star configuration and on this pole on that's coming up on the uh, left I'll just go ahead and put the uh, uh, electrical test equipment right there and uh, see what kind of readings we'll get but we'll keep you updated we'll catch you later